Morning, the Buffalo Soldiers National Museum in Midtown vandalizes racist and hateful messages. The graffiti was discovered on a day meant to honor Buffalo Soldiers nationwide. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez live from Midtown outside the museum this morning. Kathy? Absolutely very disturbing. You can see right behind me that a wall is spray painted. Someone spray painted the wall with what appears to be a swastika and a few other words. The CEO of the Buffalo Soldiers National Museum filed a police report last night saying it happened between Monday and yesterday. Yesterday was National Buffalo Soldiers Day. They painted what appears to be a swastika and other words, including Democratic Party, which is misspelled. According to the police report, neighbors called the CEO to alert him the museum had been defaced. Desmond Bertrand Pitts, the CEO of the museum and the founder's grandson, posted pictures and a message on Facebook. He writes, I never thought that in my lifetime I would see this much disrespect for humankind in historical places and right in my own backyard. He goes on to say this hurts because this is not only where I work, but it's a part of my legacy. The museum, founded in 2001, is dedicated to honoring the legacy of African-American soldiers. It's been closed now for the safety of its visitors during the COVID-19 pandemic. Reporting live in Midtown, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Okay.